welcome you to the Tower Organic Farm. We are growing organic vegetables, raising chickens, pasture, goats. We have bees for honey, fish, many other things I'm going to be introducing you to. This is a family owned farm. We believe that food is your medicine. However, to eat the right type of food, it has to be grown in the right way, the Ditawa way. Our chickens are pasture raised. It means that we let the chickens roam around all day they are not confined at all they are out as you can see we have enough room for them to look for their own food i feed them once in a while as a trick they know what to eat see this guy here He's busy digging, looking for grubs and stuff to eat. The goats come. Hey, goats! Hey, goats! Hey, goats! Hey, goats! Hey, goats! Hey, there you go. The goats are here. Come on, come on, big guy. Come on, big guy. Say good morning. The goats are here. All of them, they respond to my voice. We've got a lot of young ones here. We've had quite some birds red, uh, lately. A lot of young ones. You can see them here. Oh, looking healthy. As I said, 100% pasture raised goods. These goods, we've given them enough room to graze, enough room to move. They're walking around all day. It's going to have lean, healthy meat. Lean, healthy meat. You can see the goats are having a nice time exposed to uh, the sun all day. And this is winter, that is why. Uh, the pasture is not green, but come spring, it's going to be very green and lush. Fortunately, we catch some hay. Summer, uh, the hay is still out here. Uh, you can see that the goats are helping themselves. This is what we are, we are doing. Um, I'm going to take you to go see the beehives now. Since they've smelled me or something. Uh, look at that. The bees are beginning to come out. If you look closely, you see a lot of bees. So, this is the foundation of the bees we're going to be having on the farm. Next, I need to take you to the fish pond and the veggies and other things. take a look at the pond. Okay, the plan here is to have uh, fish. We already have some catfish in there. Uh, you can see the geese and the ducks and on the pool. That is the entire pond there. It's going to be amazing what we're going to raise in this pond. a pile of uh, chicken poop that will be applying to our vegetable uh, section of the operation 
Now it's time for go to us to go visit where the veggies are grown. Yeah, we have about 1.6 acre here for our vegetables. We already grew, we grew vegetable here last year and we're getting ready. Welcome to the uh, our first greenhouse on the on the farm. We're trying to grow fresh vegetables all year. We experimented this year with uh, this greenhouse. Most of the greenery in here right now is with our weeds. Uh, what we planted died because we don't have an external source of heating. However, I'm excited today because uh, some of uh, the plants that died are sprouting back. You can see this little this water leaf is growing back it's been warm lately so it's gonna help us give us a stock to keep up kick up the year next with uh, look at the kukuyams that also died up uh, sprouting back up uh, i think it's uh, it's good news and the water leaf it's uh, it's trying to grow as i've seen the kukuyams as well so this greenhouse you know it's going to kicks off so we'll get some stuff started in here since the temperature is a little warmer than outside and it's going to help us uh, be at the head of the the game uh, it wasn't cheap to set this up and we'll see how it's going to go it's been our first year and we're experimenting and it's quite exciting at times you may get some disappointment but on the average i think it's been really a good adventure if you want to put it like that so here's a green greenhouse you have to place it uh, east west or west east uh, sun comes from this direction and hits it all day so it makes it work um, uh, that is it this whole portion 1.6 acres corn and okra and many other veggies everything strictly organic uh, we are still felling trees here and getting the place ready.